Why do five-story pagodas laugh in the face of earthquakes? That's the question that haunted master carpenter Miyazaki Tadanao for 12 years while he was crafting one. Channeling the spirit of a painter recreating a masterpiece, he decided to build a scaled-down version of Harui's iconic pagoda to crack the code. Spoiler alert, it's all about precision, flexibility, and a bit of architectural wizardry. Turns out, the pagoda's secret is in its zen-like embrace of chaos, its components are snug yet flexible, moving with earthquakes rather than resisting them. No nails, just clever joinery that lets the whole structure sway like a slow dance. The central pillar even swings like a pendulum, ensuring the tower doesn't tip over like a drunk at karaoke night. Modern scientists, naturally curious and slightly envious of ancient wisdom, decided to test Miyazaki's model with high-tech shake tables. The result? The pagoda wobbled, teetered, and swayed, but like a seasoned sumo wrestler, it never fell. Centuries-old carpentry techniques laughed in the face of six-plus magnitude earthquakes, leaving modern engineers scratching their heads and bowing to tradition. In the end, this isn't just a tale of wood and wobble, it's a testament to ancient craftsmanship, proving that sometimes, the best way to stand tall is to learn how to sway. And don't forget, this is just the sneak peek. The full, super serious process of building a 1 to 5 scale model of the majestic 5 story Horui Temple will be released in two weeks. Mark your calendars, folks, it's going to be pillar Y good. Cheers!